So why is the CPL's deal with 21st Club the biggest in the league's history? I'm gonna let you know right here in this video, so stay tuned. Hey guys, it's Curtis here and you're watching my channel, AFC Curtis, your home for all things Canadian Premier League content right here on YouTube. So if you're new here, maybe consider hitting that red subscribe button. So when the league announced just this winter here, their partnership with 21st Club, I, I thought this was a great video idea right here, first of all, because I think a lot of people are understanding the importance of this deal. It's actually my favorite, most favorite deal that the league's ever done, first of all, in the league's very short history. It's also, I think, one of the most impactful, especially in the long term, and probably essentially one of the most important in league history. And a lot of people, again, are kind of understating it. And in this video here, I'm gonna break down essentially why this is so important. So really, let's get things started. So what is 21st Club? Well, essentially, it's a, a world-class uh, data and analytics group that collects information on players all over the world uh, from scouting reports and everything essentially if you're a good player somewhere in the world they'll find you and they'll collect that on you now this company has worked with some pretty reputable clubs here Ajax and Tottenham Hotspur were the two big ones highlighted in the CPL's press report uh, a couple weeks ago when they announced their big information uh, that they have partnered with this 21st club it's a great organization essentially guys uh, the reason why it's so important is that like I said it collects all the scouting information that scouts and coaches are gonna want on players from players that you might not have even heard of from leagues that are just under scouted like nobody scouts these leagues and they have gems hidden in there and this this company finds those gems they unearth these gems at, at a really low cost too in terms of the transfer market so overall this is a, such a smart idea for the canadian premier league to partner with them because this group kind of finds good players at low costs i don't know what else sounds great for these clubs now why is it so important for the cpl why do i think it's such an important deal for the league uh, essentially like i said it cut costs on scouting the, the league the, the teams in the league they don't they're so new that they, they have to spend so much already on terms of talent and all these other costs. Why not? You're going to have to cut costs eventually somewhere, especially this early, uh, in order to save money for another area of that club. And I think scouting, you know, last year, last season, we've had some good international players, but we had some bad international players that maybe just not really bad, but I think players that just didn't really fit into the system that that club had them in there for. And the and, and result of that was that club maybe didn't do so well because those international players didn't perform to the level that they were expected of them. So I think this kind of improves the chance of you signing an international player that will actually bring something and push the league forward and that club forward. And as we all know, the international players, especially this early in the Canadian Premier League's history, uh, international players are, are vital to the success of the Canadian Premier League in the short term and the long term because these are the talented players that are going to come into the league and going to push the pace and help really push and develop younger Canadian players and grow those young Canadian players uh, so they can get transferred and play in big, uh, big leagues all over the world, just like these international players want to do so I think the, the league hit a home run in this deal um, the deal is under you 23 players and under us uh, 23 player 23 year old players or younger and will be scouted through the system and will eventually get signed into the Canadian Premier League clubs here and this is a great deal because like I said that you're bringing these young talented players that have huge upside and the reason why it's U23 and younger is because the resale value is there they can bring in a player play them for a year or two really develop them uh, get some eyes from bigger clubs and bigger leagues in Europe or South America on them in this league and eventually sell them at a, at a really big hopefully big um, profitable rate in the transfer market and then they can get that money and reinvest it in themselves in a whole bunch of different ways so I mean this is a home run deal for the CPL and its clubs some players already brought in through the system is like Gabe Vasquez-Salos to York 9, Calvary FC signing uh, Jer Cordova, and a Valor FC signing Amir Soto. So those are three big players already, or three players I think that have a really good upside that I'm really excited to see in the CPL uh, this coming season. I've already been signed using this system in the Canadian Premier League, and there's definitely going to be more players on the way before preseason starts here, and before the uh, regular season kicks off, of course, uh, which will be a fantastic season, but the only way that we can have a higher uh, higher intensity game is to bring in these young U23 players, these international players, to push the pace of these Canadians and in total the level of play will all rise. So I mean this is going to be an exciting year because of this 21st club and it's only going to get better. Just watch. Alright guys, that was my video of this week. Uh, let me know down in the comment section below. Do you like the deal with 21st club? Do you think it's going to eventually benefit not only short term but in the long term for the Canadian Premier League? Let me know down in the comment section below. Also let me know what are your favorite international signings this offseason. 
Let's talk down in the comment section below. And of course, if you like this video, definitely hit that like button, that thumbs up button. Uh, shows me like content just like this. And of course, if you want to see more content like this, you can also check out my channel, AFC Curtis. Uh, if you want to subscribe to it, definitely hit that red subscribe button. You hit the bell notification button. You can get notified each and every week when I drop a brand new episode just like this one. And of course, you can also watch my content over at northernstarting11.com. I'll have a link for that website down in the description below. And after that, guys, I'm done with my plugs. We'll see you next week.